hello friends uh, in odoo 16 now indian localization has been added and some of the feature of gstr tds tcs reports has been added we will see in this video how tds will be applied on uh, new odoo 16 uh, indian localization i have created one vendor bill here and let's put a price 100 for easy calculation and 18 percent gst and 10 percent tds on the service invoice 194j and here you can see the base amount minus tds plus gst and all the total is the same so uh, this is how we apply tds if you have multiple line you have to manually apply tds or you can add tds on all your service type of product if you are doing adding all your service type of product you are purchasing in the system but uh, as per the indian standard uh, the best practice here is uh, we apply tds on overall bill because the tds bill will be always uh, tds applicable there will be no chance that in one uh, vendor bill there will be multiple type of tds and uh, some line without TDS and some line will, will be with TDS because TDS invoice will be always TDS invoice. So uh, in this scenario, we can create um, invoice vendor bill with multiple lines, one line without TDS, one line with 10% TDS and another line with 2% TDS, which is not the best practice. So here Serpent Consulting Services comes up with uh, another solution uh, where we created uh, vendor bill here and that's our custom solution here where you can see the vendor bill here i will add a product and then you can add a product price and the default gst here and as soon as you do you can apply the tds on overall invoice and then i can select my tds here so uh, I will select 10% TDS here and then you can see uh, the overall TDS uh, calculation GST and then TDS from the base amount. Now the another limitation of default uh, feature is for example if I paid advance and on I want to deduct TDS from advance and then on overall uh, vendor bill I uh, instead of 100 uh, rupees invoice i want to deduct tds from 50 because 50 i paid already in advance and i want to deduct uh, on the 50 only so we have that feature here the tds base amount i can enter manually otherwise it will take the default base amount so i put the default amount here and my tds will be computed accordingly so that's uh, how uh, user friendly tds calculation we have customized for uh, the module or customization or implementation you can always reach us on contact at serpentcs.com thank you very much